we are about to start the game here. Murray State University versus Davenport University. 30 seconds to pick your heroes and then a couple seconds before the doors open. This is the same stage that we played against Northwood earlier. This is Busan Temple. Gonna revolve around that central point. There is a bit of cover in the drum there. And you do have on the right side and the left side uh, different ways to get to that point. Kind of on now on the camera's left side, uh, kind of tighter halls. Uh, you know, if you want to come in and, and play a little closer. Whereas on the other side, the right hand side, and that open area allows for a little more sight lines, a little play. Curious to see which way we go. And here we go 25 seconds until the round begins. We do have on blue is the Davenport Panthers, Yokai on the Sigma, and the other tank, Billy Smash, is Arissa, so they are running the double shield. They've got Dwarves as Symmetra, Chance is the Lucio, Qua is the Moira, Rosevit is the uh, Doomfist, Gamertags, they know. <laughs> we got Chief and Aziz, same Sigma, Arissa, Flat Filth, Baptiste, Bonsai on the Doomfist, and her Reaper, and quote is Moira. And just a little disclaimer, the reason why I pan around so much right at the beginning of the match is because I'm colorblind and can't see the uh, <laughs> can't see where the players actually spawn. All them out in, the game. in shades of gray. So <laughs> both teams coming to the start here on the middle point. Immortality Field going down quickly to stabilize Murray State in the red. Shield coming down from the Orissa. Sigma Shield going in front. A halt from Davenport doesn't really do much there. We are on a point of view from Bonsai now. We can stay with him for a moment as he goes in. He's looking to get beyond that shield, waiting for the moment with his team to coordinate for the punch. That doesn't come off. They're going to try and regroup. Now the Reaper coming in, and her. Can he get around? Is he going to flank around? Right now, dancing and shooting. Sigma being aggressive from, uh, from Murray State. Goes quote with Coalescence. Another pull, bringing them all together. You can often see that's kind of one of the strategies there. Arissa doing a halt to bring them all together so a Doomfist can come in and punch them all back, separate the crowd, and do a lot of damage. Neither team really getting the advantage until now. Billy Smash with a double kill on Murray State, the Arissa. And there is three down for Murray State, four. And almost a team wide Bonsai using his ult to escape. And not a good position for Murray State at the beginning. Plenty of time to go, 5% for Davenport. They are going to regroup. Curious to see which way they go this time. Remember, this is a best of three series. In this map, it's the first one to uh, get to three. And then we will play another map after that. And if it's a tie, we'll play another one after that. Now Murray State coming in the middle. They believe this is their best chance. Symmetra or it coming in, or Symmetra Portal coming in. Tio staying in the back line, just providing that speed boost, switching to heals. Kai throwing in his orbs. He's going to do the rock. He hits Quote. Quote is low. Quote gets picked off. Not what you want to see. Needs to be a little faster getting back. And now Davenport being aggressive. Murray State in trouble early. And this is not good for Murray State. Davenport can move forward and really punish them if they want. Looks like they're not going to spawn trap them. Looks like they're going to just stay back and try and stabilize this area. Moira disengages from the other Moira. Murray State moving up on their right-hand side in the red on Davenport's left-hand side. And now we can see them retreating to the point. Here comes Murray State on the left-hand side, throwing down their shields. They're going to take this nice and slow. 70% already for Davenport. Murray State will need to make a move soon. You probably have one or two more good team fights left in this. Contesting the point, and here we go. Murray State bringing in some of their ults, they get a pick on Yokai. Billy Smash is down, and her getting the double kill. Chance manages to pick off Bonsai on the Doomfist, and Chief getting a kill. Pretty even trade so far. Nobody really coming out ahead on this team fight. Meanwhile, Davenport still getting the percentages. This seems to be an instance of uh, so similar but so different. This is a lot of what we saw in the Northwood fight, you know, comp wise and engage wise, but then there seems to be so much more coordination, especially on the part of Davenport. But they're just able to work together just as a, as a close-knit team. And you do see this. Uh, I have noticed this a lot with the double shield. Is It's going to come down to those small things and individual moments. Fortunately, Murray State able to capitalize there. And they are now 15%. If they can hold out here for one or two more team fights, they're going to be right back in it. And we'll be looking at a nail-biter of a first round. Here comes some abilities. Flavfil throwing in damage boost. 
Lucio dancing around the point with the speed boost, keeping his team mobile. Symmetra's wall coming in, trying to cut off the damage from Murray State. Murray State several down. They have the Chief left. They have Anher on the point. He's got his ult. He gets stunned by the rock and he gets picked off before he can use it. And are they going to recap? Can Murray State stay on the point? This is going to be crucial. Aziz switches over to the hamster, the wrecking ball, to stay on the point. Super mobile hero, super fast. He's going to stay there and just try to push them back as his team gets on the point and gives him reinforcements. And there they are. Here come the Murray State Racers. Looks like Davenport may come away with it. Murray State still ticking up time, though, in all this. They keep getting staggered, but they're still getting the time. Davenport unable to get a foothold. No picks coming in yet. No kills right now. See Ann Hurd dancing on the point. Moira. Oh, three down for Murray State. That is no good. Bonsai still alive. Chief goes down as well. And Bonsai and Aziz keep the hopes alive for the Murray State Racers in the first map. First round. Oh, and not good. Doomfist, Bonsai, and Aziz both go down. And Davenport takes first round on Busan. Yeah, you could definitely tell that was a, a much harder game for Murray State. <laughs> Um, there's just less room to make mistakes uh, as Davenport knew exactly how to capitalize. Anytime they were out of position, weren't right behind the shield properly, they would just immediately move in on that. They'd pick off that person and use that momentum to just finish off the point. Definitely no room for errors in this map against this team. Uh, Northwood, a uh, much easier time for Murray State. Uh, these teams, though, look to be about uh, even. Uh, Davenport definitely playing very well today. And Murray State not playing bad. They, they did really well there. Um, that's a game where it, one more one team fight goes a different way and it's a completely different story, I think. And so now we see the same loadout from the previous round for Murray State. And I believe the exact same for Davenport. Any big changes to speak of? Would you say it's a good decision to keep their comps how they were and just see if they could do it again, or would you have preferred them to change something up between fights? I think so. The only change I would see is maybe Phil switching from Baptiste to his main, which is on it. But again, Busan, especially this map, doesn't provide a whole lot of the sight lines that you need for that sort of heals. So it's not bad to stick with it, I think. They are going to have to be more clinical. Of course, Doris did switch to the Reaper. He gets eliminated by Anher. Anher is going to have to step it up. He's playing very well. They're going to rely on their DPS to come up big. Oh, Murray State getting wiped again. And here you go. And we saw this from Murray State against Northwood. They're going to come up and hold them with chokehold. Murray State's going to need to figure out something here because this is a deadly spot to get caught. This is exactly where we saw Northwood um, trying to get through when they faced Murray State. And it's just very difficult, especially if you've got someone on the upper level. It just prevents any kind of going around. And then you just hold that choke point with all your shields. And there's just not much you can do unless you can get past the tanks. And Davenport playing that perfectly up high gives them perfect advantage on it because here, Murray State doesn't have to come down the middle. Murray State could come over to the right or to the left, but they're pushed so far up that Davenport can see any move they make. So this is a big, big test for Murray State here. That is probably the first or second time we've seen team will happen to them this evening. How is this composure going to hold? And we see some switches coming in. This will be interesting. Blavfil switching over to the Mercy. They're going to run the Pharmacy. You saw this strategy from Northwood. They were not able to make it work. Let's see if they can get value out of the fire here. It's, if we can get the angle on in her there. Or this angle is fine. Let's see what's going on. Bonsai as well, switching to the McCree. Or springing in the ult. Only manages to find the McCree. And her, hoping to go up big, gets eliminated by Yokai. The Sigma just going off and getting... There's a triple. And it's coming down to the individual kills, making a big difference here. That's pretty much what we saw with Northwood, where they try to run the pharmacy kind of as a last second, desperate last resort, throw it all out there, see if it works. And again, similarly, it, it really didn't seem to do much. They just immediately got picked off. And we do see them... Davenport getting a little caught out. Will they cope with this? They did not read this very well. But they do have the abilities and the skill to make up for it. They get, oh, several picks there. Chief and her and Bonsai all going down in disease as well. What is the last one remaining? He's going to have to get out of there. Got the coalescence, and then he needs to get the heck out or just go ahead and die so he can regroup with his team. Which he does. They're not going to get back in time. That's another team kill and a brilliantly played game from Davenport. So that is the first map out of the way. Davenport Panthers up one to nothing. It is a best of three series, and Murray State looks to come back in the next uh, map. 
will be decided momentarily to win that. Play the game Qua as the uh, Moira. You can see here just getting caught in that middle. Not a whole lot you can do there. You got to be a little bit more mobile. I just want to want to talk about that that last play by Murray State where they went in trying to go around the edge, just try to get that at the last second, and it was a good idea. But the enemy Sigma just immediately the Davenport Sigma caught everybody in his ult, doing so much damage, it pretty much just negated the entire play.